All right, let's move on to the other song from D4VD, 2016. Now, for these two songs, I saw that he he mentioned that he wrote it uh, a few weeks ago, a month ago, uh, with his friends. So let's check it out. I want to buy my oh, that sounds familiar. Um. Uh. 2000s punk rock? I want to buy my Oh, wow. I'm not gonna lie, the lyrics, uh, the lyrics really took a twist right there. <laughs> it made it, it made it so much more, um, so much more depressing. <laughs> but hey, for me, I don't, uh, lyrics don't really matter unless it's like very, very important to me. So, you know, I'm just going with the feeling of the song. Ooh. Okay. I'm not the same kid I was in twenty six. I was young, I was dumb, now I overthink it. Then I should and I could and you wouldn't believe what I did as a kid back in twenty sixteen. You know, that's another thing uh, I really like about D4VD is that his music is not just purely... Well, I mean, <laughs> the lyrics are kind of sad in this one, but for the most part, like, just the feeling of the songs is not, like, uh, all of them is, like, just purely, 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 like, sadness and all that. Like, he has some songs where it's, um, it's just enjoyable to, li to listen to, so, you know? Especially on Lost Petals, uh... I think the first three tracks were like depressing and all that. The fourth track was uh, a more energetic song to like switch up the mood and all that, which was uh, for me, it, it, it was dope to listen to it like that. Uh, you know, but that was cool. You know, I I, 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 I could see why people might not really enjoy this one as much as some of the other ones, because, you know, this is not like purely, purely like high notes, purely like singing, singing like that. That enjoyable, enjoyable singing, but um, to me, I, I still fuck with it. 